Bing made me 10 grand. Nope. ChatGPT4 made me 10 grand. Here's how. Well, first, let me ask you a question. Have you ever watched my YouTube channel? Have you seen how much content I've made? Well, it's a fair amount. I, I make content daily on YouTube, Twitter, and for a while I was actually doing it on two YouTube channels and Instagram and TikTok. Now, with all this output, what I was able to do is essentially build a brand for myself that I know how to talk about apps. I know how to talk about apps for sure. You know, like at some point when you make daily uploads for a year on talking about apps, people are gonna respect that. But I didn't get where I am without help. One, I have an awesome editor, but two, I also have this fun assistant called ChatGPT. And more specifically with ChatGPT4, what I've been able to do is implement very easy systems in order to create exceptional amounts of content. So first and foremost, what you need to know about my business is that I not only create content, but I lead people to different sales funnels, like courses, products, like Notion templates. I have sponsors on my channel, and I also work as a small content agency for apps specifically, where I end up making videos for their internal YouTube channels. So between all of these different revenue streams, I'm gonna break down sort of where they come from and how I'm able to use ChatGPT to my advantage. So what I would recommend that most of you do in order to get to where I'm at is that you have a list of different prompts to choose from. So if we go here, there's this chat GPT for priming tweets and bullets. And what this essentially does is it's a primer to show ChatGPT what exactly is a good tweet. So I really like this structure where it's very short and quippy and there's a line break between each one. And you can tell ChatGPT4 to put line breaks and do all those sort of things, but unless it has an example, it doesn't necessarily do a good job. So first of all, one of my revenue streams has been, I've just been getting more members on my podcast through basically people are going to my Twitter, they're signing up for my newsletter and then becoming a member. So that's been a little bit more in revenue every month. But also when they sign up to my new newsletter, they are getting put into an email marketing funnel and getting sold my Notion templates. And you can see in the last couple months, this has definitely jumped up with over $1,200 in sales in both February and March, which was around the time I started using ChatGPT4 for an extension of my email marketing funnel. And it was also the place where I improved the landing page copy too. So I use MailChimp as my email marketing platform. And in these journeys, I have this drip campaign and essentially it's split into sending them information about some of my templates that are more general and then a specific one. I started working on this a couple months ago. But to be 100% honest, outside of me putting these gifts in here, this was pretty much written with a basic outline in ChatGPT. I did not write out much of this email. I didn't have to think about it. It even wrote the different headers in here and it's made it extremely easy to get more sales. It wrote all this text about the promo code that I have. And from there, I work with a company called hints.so and I have an affiliate link with them. And that affiliate link ends up allowing me to get more revenue into the business by selling this Notion template and referring them to hints at the same time. In the last couple of months, I've also dropped a lot of new premium templates, whether it be the Notion app system, my second brain, or the getting things done template. And all three of these have allowed me to have very nice structured pages that once again were written with landing page copy from ChatGPT that then allow me to get this recurring revenue of around 1200 bucks a month. At the same time, I dropped a course on Skillshare called Mastering Notion where the majority of the descriptions and whatnot that were created in the titles of the different modules were all written and ideated from me asking ChatGPT what would be a good order of modules to do in this course and how would you summarize this course in a paragraph and from there my skillshare immediately went from paying me around a hundred dollars or actually more like fifty dollars a month to a hundred and then over 360 dollars in a month because I was getting a lot more referrals because the course was good and I was plugging it on my YouTube channel I'm trying to show you some hard numbers in the last couple of months but I, I can't necessarily show you hard numbers of some of the last things I'm gonna bring up, which are just, I've gotten much more opportunities from different applications. This is partially because I've been making content on apps for so long, but if you put enough reps in, it really helps you out. And 
the only way to put a lot of reps in in this current economy is either brute force yourself or get help from AI to give you more ideas, write outlines of videos, and continuously churn out content through a little bit easier of a system. So in the last couple of months, I've made thousands of dollars on sponsors that I wouldn't have before. And it's also allowed me to have opportunities to make videos for applications and plug my workflows into their systems to get them to be more efficient. Using make.com and Zapier, I have a system where essentially after a video is rendered, it goes into this insane workflow where it transcribes the video. And then after it's transcribed, and this also is included for podcasts too. So on my main YouTube channel, we have transcription that turns into, let's make a YouTube description out of it. Let's make tags out of it. Let's make a community post out of it. Let's make a blog post and have the tags and descriptions written for that. I also do have LinkedIn posts, Twitter threads, Twitter tip posts, all these sort of things taken from my videos. And by having this whole system built out, I'm able to easily scale the content that I'm able to produce for companies because I make a video for them, I can transcribe it, and then it goes through this whole system. Now, this only costs me like maybe $100 a month between the two automation platforms. And by doing that, I'm able to, instead of having to pay a second editor or pay someone to write the blogs, I'm able to leverage the time of my editor much better because on my channel, he doesn't have to write my descriptions or my tags or my community posts anymore. It's just like done. So freed up time for him and me. And now we just have the ability to produce more content. So this made me more money because I'm able to just produce more content for stuff that's outside of my YouTube channel. I'm able to make, you know, couple deals for a couple grand. If I'm able to make deals for $5,000 for content clients and you know, it's recurring revenue around there, then what I'm able to do is save time on my own videos with these workflows and then also save time on their videos with these workflows. So essentially I'm back to the same level of work I was, you know, in the fall before ChatGPT came out with an ex with a significant amount of capacity increase and it's much more scalable when you have automation in there rather than needing to hire more employees. So since implementing ChatGPT, revenue has been well over 10 grand, but I just wanted to make a fun title because it hasn't been like 100 yet. I was gonna say like 30 or I was, I was gonna throw out the real numbers. So I was like, eh, I'm gonna vaguely say over 10 because a lot of people want to make that kind of money online. In a few months of working with ChatGPT, I think any of you could start making 10 grand in revenue a month. It's really just about putting your mind to it based on your skill set. I'm good at making content. I'm good at talking in front of a camera. If you're able to figure out what you're good at and pair it with ChatGPT, you can be making a lot more money and saving a lot more time than you think possible. Just like you could become way more productive if you checked out this video right here.